Hello everyone, thank you for watching Tubal Videos. In this video, I want to explain a little bit about Kodi, um, give you a quick overview of how it works, what its purpose is, and how to use it. So, for starters, Kodi is an open source media center software. By open source, that means that all of the source code that creates the system is open to the public and anyone that wants to can download the software, make adjustments to it, um, create different applications from it, etc. And Kodi can be installed on all of these different types of devices. So Windows, Linux, Mac, Android, um, you know, the Raspberry Pi board and, and also a lot of other boards. Um, not only the Raspberry Pi. Now, what's so special about Kodi is that it's capable of playing uh, all types of different media formats. And so pictures, you know, you can add pictures. Um, you would have to select from a source. So now that I've popped in that thumb drive, you can see we have an option for Lexar. And I'll just come out of Toolbox. And here's one of Here's a picture that's on that thumb drive. And so we can actually create like a slideshow. Um, right now I've got it paused. I can hit back and some other pictures that are on that uh, thumb drive. And so you can also play videos that are on a, on a thumb drive or on your local computer. And so if I go to Files and go to Lexar, Toolbox, um, here's a video. Every sporting event, music. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I've been, I'm doing this for And so, yeah, you can play local uh, saved videos, music, etc. Um, but what really makes uh, Cody special is the ability to add repositories and so as you can see here I've got two different repositories that are connected um, to this uh, Cody Media Center um, the Tubal repo which um, has access to um, add-ons that we build here at Toolbox and the Super repo which contains uh, add-ons um, from the super repository and you know they've got just about everything that you can imagine not every not all of them but you know most of the good add-ons um, are available in the super repo so you'll want to you'll want to add both of those um, to your system and so let's let's show you how an add-on works so here under videos I'll go to add-ons now right now I have one add-on it's called Genesis and Genesis is an add-on that's really good for finding movies and TV shows and documentaries and things like that. And so, um, but there's other add-ons that serve different purposes. So, for example, here's one channel, um, et cetera, et cetera. And scroll on down and you'll see, like, right now there's 1,549 add-ons that are available in here just from adding the two rep repositories that I showed you and so let's say that you actually want one of these add-ons let's let's go ahead and select Phoenix um, and just so that you know like part of the service that we offer here at Tubal is uh, keeping you updated on which um, add-ons will help you gain access to the type of content that you're looking for and so right now you can see that the Phoenix add-on is downloading. So while that's while that's downloading, let's go ahead and take a look at Genesis. So I'll open up Genesis. And so you see we start off with the option for movies, TV shows, channels. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and go to TV shows. Now you can filter by all of these different options, but I'm going to just do a search for the sake of this example. Hit done. So after doing a search, it's going to pull up um, all the different options that have the words home movies in it. Um, but I'm going to select this one. 
And so now you can see we have all the different seasons. I'll select the season. And then we have all of the different episodes. And so if I pick an episode. Then after that, you'll see a list of all the different servers along with the, the media quality. Um, the MQ stands for medium quality. The LQ is low quality. HQ is high quality. Um, if you see HD, then that is 720p high definition. And if there is a 1080p option um, for high definition, then it will specifically say 1080p. I've noticed that even LQ can look like really good. Um, so don't be afraid of selecting like an MQ or an LQ, especially if you have like a low um, internet connection speed or if you're on Wi-Fi. Um, sometimes it's a good idea to select from one of the lower quality versions. Um, so I'll just go ahead and click one. And so you can see it's now pulling it um, from the server. If, if, if one of them crash um, or does not connect, then you can always select from one of the other server options, which is why you're presented with you know, a long list. Um, and so once there's a connection established, the movie will begin playing, or the show will begin playing. And so if we come back down to our video add-ons, I'll just go back up, back up. So here's the Phoenix that we just added. And so Phoenix is real good for sports and um, international channels. Um, so for example, if I go into the Crusader, and we've got Arabic channels, we've got international channels. And so we can browse um, all the different countries. Um, that you know have content and so like if I select Japan for example um, we could select this one and connect why do you sit with them I want to sabotage their love hold it hold it hold it <laughs> don't try to get there are also music add-ons so you can look through the music um, tubal mixtapes is an add-on that we built um, it connects to live mixtapes and you can literally like listen to any mixtape that's that's on live mixtapes as long as well as our own server you can hit get more and these are um, you know based on the super repo uh, repository that I've got connected these are all of the different um, add-ons for music and so you see even Pandora and um, SoundCloud is in here, Shoutcast, SoundCloud, so you can install the SoundCloud app, Spreaker, you know, et cetera, et cetera. Like tons of different options. Um, in fact, there's 218 music options uh, just with this, you know, repository that I've got connected right now. So that about covers it. You know, essentially, Kodi is it's a media center software that basically allows you to play from all your different media types. And whether they're locally stored or remote hosted, um, you'll be able to play them, stream them um, in one easy to manage, easy to use, convenient piece of software. So that's about it for right now. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to get in touch with us. We'll be happy to assist. Bye for now.